Well, good morning, y'all. Baby Wyler here with you. Uh, we just came over, checked our piggies, or checked our cows. Yeah, man, my, I'm still waking up. Sorry, haven't had enough coffee yet. Checked on our cows, and they all look good. Whoa. Wrong button there for a minute. I don't know what I did. All right. Well, I guess we figured that out. <laughs> my mouse fell off my side. But anyway, back to the character. Ah, uh, we're here. Uh, we checked our cows. Everything looks good for them. So we're going to head on over to the piggies. Uh, we got a message on our little iPad there, our tracking system, that we need to get some food in for the pigs. So we're going to go take care of that today. And we'll. And I guess we got some. Uh, what do we got to do? Uh, we got a. Cletus is going to come down. He's going to help us put some. Plant the last field in oats so we can get that in. And we're going to. We got to get a field there cultivated. So. We're going to. I think we're going to work on. I think we got, what, two, maybe three fields to cultivate yet. And, uh, well, we want to try to get some grass fertilized, so I'm not sure. We might put Cletus, we might, uh, once he gets done planting, might put him over in a cultivator. I don't know yet. I'm going to try to figure all this out. But we got some grass we need to try to get fertilized, and we're going to try to use some of our slurry up on that and see how that'll work out. And, but first things first, piggies need food, so we need to make sure we take care of them. just a beautiful morning I'm just cruising around looking around I, I, I should be paying a little more attention to the road I guess <laughs> but well I'm drinking my coffee too so like I said we're gonna get down here and take care of these here piggies I guess there's a car coming better wait for him to decide where he wants to go as yes, these people down here uh, they're so relaxed they don't use turn signals like you know that lever's on the side of your steering wheel there for a reason oh but you'll use your brake lights i see how it is what the heck you're already going slow enough you don't need to hit the brakes uh but yeah we gotta get some pig food in here make sure they got water and all that good stuff and get this all figured out uh, oh yeah I guess I need to go to the other side oh, we'll just drive around how's that we got poop in there yet doesn't look like it of course can't see much out these tinted windows I keep forgetting our tractors are over here I go to the garage and you know I don't think you need to go in the garage before we get out of the truck here Let's pull up this iPad. Look, where did I set that? Oh, there it is. Piggies. They need water, straw, and base food. So, yeah, we got to do some work here. Let's take care of them quick. Hop out. There's our straw bales. Well, we might need... We got straw in here. Not sure. Yeah, we're full. We'll empty this out first. Still haven't figured out that messed up straw trigger over here, so close your eyes while I give them straw, okay? <laughs> um, we got to figure out what we're going to do here about this straw trigger because I'm not. If it takes bales, we'll just sell this straw blower and we'll go from there. But for right now, just close your eyes because, well. You don't need to see this. They should be good on straw now. Yep, good on straw. So we need water and we need base food. And we need piggy food. Whoa. Oh, that's weird. I didn't know I could do that. 
I can reverse the driving direction. That screws everything up. Wow! Um, this tractor's kind of weird. Be right back, folks. All right, got that all figured out. I was hitting the wrong button there on that control arm. I wanted to, you know, I thought I had a speed button to switch the transmission from forward to reverse, and well, I do, but <laughs> the tractor also got a function where we can uh, change the driving direction on the tractor. Like if we put a mower on the back, you know, and want to drive with the big wheels in the front, yeah, that way. Yeah, so it's just all weird. Oh well, I told you, I'm, I'm just not used to all this fancy technology stuff. So, all right, we got that figured out now. And we got, oh, I'm stuck. Guess we got to move it over a little bit. This big boy, I told you, I might not be, they may call me baby, but I'm not exactly that much of a baby. I'm a pretty big boy. I get stuck between tractors and walls while we're a little crooked. Oh well, it'll go back in there. There we go. All right. Well, now we're gonna get some pig food. Take this on over. I do like these fence though. They are pretty fun to drive. So let's swing around here. Oh, uh, looks like we got to clean them up. They made a little bit of a mess. Can we make it without hitting the pole? I don't want to take down my pig chute. Definitely don't want to take down the pig chute today, folks. I'd like to get a better one up there to begin with, but don't need to be doing it today. There we go. While that's gone, we're going to go get some water. All right, that should be good for the water. And we should be good on pig food. Let's pull up our handy damn where did I put that there iPad at? Oh, right there it is. All right, cleanliness is the only thing we gotta do, but I'm not too worried about that today. We got other stuff we gotta get to today. So I'm gonna put this tractor on back in the stall and I'm gonna head down to the other farm. So I shall see you when we get down there. How's that? All right, see ya. All right, folks, we got Cletus out there started on the field. Bubba swears this here plow's ready to rock and roll, so let's hop in here and fire the old tractor up, and let's go see if uh, see if we can get that done. I'll fold this up, maybe. There we go. We'll go back here to the field, and we're going to get get our fields cultivated up. So I hope y'all have been enjoying the series. I know I like having y'all ride with. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not the road we want to go. Can we spin around the windmill without taking it out? Good job. All right. That's not the first that that field there should be planted, I, I think. I think. Hold on one second. Let me let me pull up that iPad kiss wheel. Now now that I think about it, I'm a little mistake. No, we did plant that. Yes, we planted that. We want this next one up here. What was I all but run into the fence? Oh boy. Alright, let's get this one done. Throw the drone out here. We're gonna go over here to this end and this is where we're gonna start. Let's turn on our GPS, let's get rid of that. 
we'll get a straight line going down this end of the field. That's that's what sounds good. All right, I'll back this up just a little bit. There we go. And we're off. Get ourselves a straight line going here. We're going to get this field cultivated on up. That'll work for me. So how y'all been doing? I hope y'all been doing good. I, I've been trying to get the field work caught up here. and Well, we're just not ready to put corn and soybean in the ground yet. And that's what we're going to do up here. I know Cletus was talking to me. and He's got he put his sugar beets in the other day trying out that new planter they brought. That was good. So, I guess we got to, uh, well, he's got, he's waiting on corn and soybean and cotton. But he, he seems to be caught up on all the other planting. So that works good for him. So we'll see what happens for us here. We're just going to get, get the seed, the seed bed ready. I, I want to. I wanted to try to do some, was going to do some spraying, throw some slurry down in the grass, get that ready to be for a first cut, but, well, we decided to hold off on that, because Bubba wanted me to try this, try this, uh, this cultivator out, this disc, and make sure things are doing right, so, Cletus should be up over the yonder there somewhere, not sure where. Yeah, he's up there. He's working away. But anyhow, uh, Bubba wanted us to try this, make sure the bearings were working right. And well, the work's got to get done. I know. I know you guys are, you know, kind of like, well, I want to ride with him, do this, do that. But dang, we got some dive bomb crows. Whoo! You see that, folks? Almost took out the drone. Look at him. Man, I tell you, some suicidal crows, I guess. Man, well, it's going to pick up this little slack that we missed here. So that we won't get with the, with the headland row. So what do you think of this equipment here we got? I know I, it's not as fancy as, uh, as Cletus as it is, but, well, we got that universal GPS we threw in here and seems to be working fine for us so we're going to continue to use it get stuff done but like I said we're just not ready to get over into that fertilizing yet slinging that slurry it's well I'd like to get it done but like I said Cletus wants or yeah, Cletus. Bubba wants us to make sure we got this right because he's got some work to do up at Cletus's farm. So he wants us to make sure this plot, this disc is running right. And so I figure we may as well try it. We don't want to piss off Bubba because I tell you, there's not many good me mechanics around here. He's one of the best at turning wrenches. We need him. So we're just going to do our job and do what he says. If it works well, we'll, we'll get this field done because I don't like to start something and not finish it. So we'll get this here field done and if it works all right, we'll just take a break before we do the other ones because it's not that critical that we get the seed beds ready yet. But just not to that point. Now we got time before we can put corn and, and beans in the ground and but we're getting we're getting up there where we soon need to make a get some fertilizer on that grass because it's growing and I just don't want to miss out on that. I want to make sure we get a good cut for that first cut. Why do we keep missing a little bit? And we're missing a little bit there. 
I must not, I, wow, I must not be turning too good. I don't know. But we're going to get this cultivated up. And like I said, we just normally, well, no, I wouldn't because this is going to be, I'm pretty sure this one here is a cornfield. This one here, we're doing, oh, uh, yeah, we're putting corn in this. So, no, I wouldn't direct till the corn, but I just, I don't know. We're taking a gamble with the wheat and the oats, and we direct tilled that, but I just, I don't know what kind of condition the guy, you know, how picky the old farmer was on with his, uh, with his seed beds here. So, I know what job I can do, and you know they always say you want the job right, do it yourself. Don't always don't trust somebody else to do it. So we're gonna try and get it done here with our, get this here done. Whoa, back it on up. You missed you overturned it. Auto steer won't take over when you do that, bud. Oy oy oy. There we go. All right. So anyhow. We're going to prepare this seed bed, make sure she's all good to go, and we'll see what happens. But So we're, we're going to try and get this field done, and then we're going to try to lay some slurry down in the fields, I'm pretty sure. I, I think that's going to be the game plan. I know I keep repeating myself, but we all, you know how it is. You got, you know, farming, you don't got a whole lot of time to make a plan and write it down, so... I figure if I, I talk to myself and I, I try to put the plan out, you know, and, well, I can kind of, I kind of come to agreement. I just don't know. I just got to get the hay fields ready to rock and roll, and, of course, got to get these fields ready, and we did decide, though, we're not going to put the other cattle barn in yet. We're going to wait till next year to do that, so... We have that extra hay field. We're gonna take care of that, let it grow, and we won't tear that up till till the fall. Uh, when the construction crews come in, we are gonna put some beef feed lots in. We definitely decided we're gonna do that, but that's gonna be for next year. But because we're just we're not ready for it yet. We want to make sure we're we're gonna give this a go, and we're gonna make sure we got you know a good job here and. Things are we're just working out in our favor. But I tell you, this tractor sure doing a good job. She pulling this disc real good. Kinda wish we could see Cletus up there, but we're I guess we're just a couple couple fields too far away. <laughs> but I sure is nice to be back at it. I tell you what. After that debacle up in Iowa, I just, whoo. Nice to have a place I can call home. Be back in the fields working. So, I just trying to, I trying to think. I guess really where we're at, that's about the best game plan I can I can figure on. Cause I tell you folks, it, it's just well There's just not a whole lot to do at this time of year. Just not a whole lot to do. But we're trying. Cause let's see here. I pull up my iPod. My put the there's my iPad. Let's pull this up here right quick. See, we got to get. We're gonna work. We're working on this field. We're planting that field up here's. Or no, we're we're disking disking this field up here's. Cletus, he's planting that field for us. We go over here. Hmm. That's pretty much where we're at. And we got to get this grass field fertilized and this area fertilized. Because that's what we own. See, that's what we own. 
Now Cletus, he's got some fertilizing to do here in his grass fields as well, but, well. And he's all caught up with his cultivating, so there's not a whole lot we can do. We can't even help him out a whole lot. Maybe we, well, maybe, I will have to see if he has needs needs a hand on some contract work. You know, maybe we go out and help our neighbors out, because, well, like I said, we're basically done. He's got a little bit of catching up to do, and... Well, we're gonna have to start some hay work here soon, but it just it, it's just not ready yet. So not quite sure. Not quite sure. Oh, look at that airplane. He's flying a little low, I guess. Huh. Because we don't have an airport here on County Line. Maybe he's sightseeing. Taking them, what are they called? Uh, I can't remember the name of them now, folks. Well, they take them photos from the air. I sure would like that picture of the farm that way. That'd be pretty neat. Uh, can we turn without hitting the post? Yeah, we got it this time. Probably not next time. Drop that cultivator. There we go, and off we go. But yeah. Um, uh, it'd be nice to get one of them photographs here of the farm, but, well, I just don't know. Are we missing another slot? We are. What is going on? Huh. Let me throw that drone out. Are we missing it the whole way down through? It sure does look like it. See if I can move that over a little bit. There we go. Now what did I just do? I just boogered up with button something fierce. All right, we're going to have to pull up. Give me one second here, folks. We got to pull up our little handy dandy. Handy dandy little GPS screen because well, we we done We done did this. Let me show them lines. Let me get out of here. Oh yeah, we're way off. Let's turn them over there. move these lines over here and we're going to turn around we're going to go back up the same line again folks because we want to make sure we got everything let's try it right there how about that we're going to go right back up the same line I tell you maybe this uh Universal GPS isn't going to be such a good thing. Man, if it keeps missing spots like that, well, we may have to use it. You know, I was going to finish the field and say I'll be back with you, but, well, you know me. I like to keep uh, keep these little things in the, in the vlog because maybe you all might have the same incident somewhere down the line where, you know, you might need to see this. It might help you out, so I don't know. We will, uh, we're going to keep on going, and I think we got it fixed now, folks. I, I, I hope so. We're going to, because of that pole being there, I think we're going to go fix that other little skipper and then come back for the next row, and, and we'll see what happens. I'll keep you with for that little bit yet, and, and then we'll see where it goes, because, well, I, I kind of, I didn't want to have the whole video of me cultivating, but, well, I don't know. It might be kind of comedic. Who knows? Let's get this little skipper here. Mm 
Oh, not that line. Not that line, GPS. Oh my, this is just, this is just turning out. Wow, I, t I, t I swear to you, folks, my driving's not this bad. Really isn't. We're trying this new fancy GPS though, and I, I like I told you, my technology not te the, the, the technology is not. I'm not up on it. I'm not as smart. I'm not. Uh, I may be young, but well, we was never brought up and shown it, so just didn't have the money for all that stuff at the farm. If it came on the tractor, it did now. Now, now, Cooter, well, he he had it because but he had the big farm, and well, every once in a while we'd go down and help him out. But he'd be like, he'd put me in tractor, he'd be like, now, baby, this button does this, and this button does this. Don't touch that button. Don't touch that one. You'll be ejected out of the tractor. I, I, I swear to you guys, that's what he told me. I asked him, I said, well, why not touch that button? What's it going to do? He says, well, baby, you touch that button, you're going to go through the roof. I'm like, I'm not touching that button. No, siree. But... <laughs> Like I said, we know some of this stuff. I'm not as dumb. I just think I think it's funny. I, it's my sense of humor, folks. I, I'm not really a dummy. I, I might be a few knives short of the knife block, but well, who isn't? You know, you know how that goes. It, it's just I'm not as smart as your average Joe when it comes to technology. Just not. I, if it was up to me, I'd drive these these older tractors and and be done with it. But like I said, you know. Down here in, in 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 county line, we we don't have many trees out there at the end of the fields to you know point and drive. And uh, Cletus told me he put these uh, GPS units in here for a reason and says, well, you know, use them. You're going to need them. It will make life more productive. So, well, we done tried it, and we're gonna we're gonna use it, and it's just. That that's how it's going. That's how it's going to go. We're going to try it, and it makes for good videos. You know these vlogs. You guys like to see that kind of stuff. I tell you what, my brain just went complete squirrel. I I don't I lost track of everything we was talking about. I don't know what I wanted to say. One minute we're talking about the plant, the farm, the plan on the farm, and next minute we're talking about technology, and next minute we're we're talking about running slurry. As long as we don't, well, no, we won't even go there. But, uh, I don't know, folks. There's no point in, I guess Cletus not done up there yet. Let me see if I fly the drone over there, see if we can see him yet. I can't see him. We're still too far away. He's up there on the end field, that's for sure. But, um, there's no, if he ain't done, there ain't no point in us trying to get something else done. Because we got to get this field done. We're almost there, but we're not just quiet. And uh, my marker's coming up there. We're, man, we almost used that 30 minutes all on this vlog about cultivating, getting, making sure this one's working right. But I think we got her, folks. I think we got the depth good. I, I like how that seed bed looks for the corn. Let me, we'll stop here. We'll get out and I'll show you. We'll show you that seed bed there pretty good. Yeah, see, I like it. There's not many clumps of grass. It seems to be tearing it all up pretty good. And Well, you see how we had last year's stubble. This year was, a, I believe, a wheat field, maybe, or rye. I'm not sure. I think it looks more like wheat, but it's stubbling it up pretty good, so I can live with that. And I think the depth's looking pretty good back here. Yeah, that looks pretty good. So I'd say Bubba hit the nail on the head with this. And we're coming up on that magic moment, so I think what we're going to do, I'm going to apologize that you guys all had a ride along for yet another cultivating of a field, but, you know, hey, the work needs done. You know, that's farming. That's that's what we got to do, so, you know, that, that's just it. And, um... The work needs done. And, and this video vlog is all about, you know... It's real life farming, you know, so it's all about you seeing what goes into it. Maybe some of you guys, it'll it'll make you want to become a farmer. Some of you guys might not make you want to be a farmer. I don't know, but, you know, it's kind of like that TV show Survivor, you know. We show you what happens. But um, 
Anyhow, before I go all squirrel on you again, and you know, squirrel, and uh, that's something that runs in the Weilers. For, that's an inside joke with us Weiler boys, I tell you. It, it's just, you know, uh, our minds just do that. I think it happens to all of us. I don't know what the heck is going on out there in front of us, but holy cow. There's a lot of lines out there. I just don't know. It looks like those cars are going really, really, really fast. But uh, anyhow, there we go. See, I told you. Squirrel. We go squirrel moment all over again. But anyhow, like I said, I, I'm, I, I promise you, we'll try to get something new to do next time. And I just really do appreciate you all hanging out with us. And it's definitely a lot of fun. And, well, it, it's it's been an experience for us. And... Hopefully we can do right by y'all and turn this farm around and everybody will be happy. But, uh, um, you know, I'm hoping y'all like it and we'll go by that. But we're getting to our magic. Yep, there's a pole in front. I thought for sure I saw a pole up there. So we're going to start turning here so we can lift this up and maybe I don't want y'all to see me hit a pole. I don't, can we, we miss it? Yeah, we missed it. Alright, well, we'll swing this around here. But, uh, anyhow, we're going to wrap it up, and we're going to let the producers do their thing, and we're going to go see what we can do about getting the rest of our stuff done and caught up, and that way we can get you something new to watch. And I'm going to finish this field here without the cameras rolling, and go check on Cletus. And, uh, I'm not sure who you're going to be with on Friday, but be one of us, I'm sure. But, uh, anyhow... You take good care of your neighbors now, you hear? And take darn good care of yourselves, because uh, if you're not in good health and you don't take care of yourselves, you can't pay it forward and take care of your neighbors. So, you guys do that, and I'll do the same, and happy farming, y'all. God bless you. We'll see you. Bye.